<laughs> but it, it really is that case of people come yeah. up and they say, oh, I was offended by that joke. And, yeah. uh, uh, my first reaction is, I don't care. Mm-hmm. Like, what, that doesn't mean anything. You're, you're telling me how you feel. What, what, I want to say why. why and, and I'll explain to them. I'm willing to explain to them why the joke isn't offensive. I, I, I'm not one of the people that think, I'm going to say what I want, I'm going to be as offensive and then go fuck you as a joke. I actually, I'm willing to explain why it's not offensive. That often offence comes when people mistake the subject of a joke with the actual target and they're not necessarily the same particularly if you deal in taboo subjects which I do Mm -hmm. because I want to go there because I want to take the audience by the hand and take them through a scary forest I mean I like I like the discomfort of of expressing and talking about really uncomfortable things because that, that's that's what most people worry about. Most if you're in a, a safe world where your firstborn isn't dying of dysentery and you're not being shot at, the worst thing that happens is something embarrassing happens to you, or you say a stupid thing or bad service. So that's why I deal with those things because everyone understands it.